Such video C. Hello and welcome to more Final Video C 3.5. It is Maddie along with Della. And here's the controls heading for the mansion. Yeah, but first I think I need to pick up the other ship to actually get to the mansion. Or the manor. In and the manner of speaking. No. I don't want to fly over the mountains. I want to freaking park my ship. Did you get more potion ships? No. Get some potions, please. Well, first I'm taking a nap. That's fine, then get some potions. Just okay. had to put yourself in the front, huh? Yes. Wait, 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 wait. Are you meaning to buy potions? Those only restore 50 hit points. Fine. I mean, I'm not saying they're bad to have. Oh my god. Look how expensive that is, man! I didn't tell you to buy that many. Buy like 50 or so. 30 is fine. Do 30. And then get some regular potions. Alright, I'm happy with that. Go down here. We're going down, down. Bro, I was taking two steps. You didn't have to attack me. I love the landscape there, though. Yeah, that's pretty. Is this like a demon kangaroo magician? It's a hellguru mage. What the hell, guru? And then we get the tiny ship. That goes way too freaking fast. And then we can take that through these mountains, because the Invincible gets pushed out of these mountains. And we'll also kill some gargoyles on the way, though. With our auto-attack button. Where's your artillery now? That's technically below us. Set. Oh, that's right. It is on the other ship. And this mansion man, I think. God oh, freaking damn. <laughs> Screw it, I'm leaving. <laughs> Do you remember how I did his voice? No. Crap. Welcome back, warriors. Une and I have been busy preparing for your arrival. Oh, okay. We're getting teleported away. Where the frick are we? Doga's voice echoed down the hall. Make your way through the tunnel. We await you at the end. Better not be any freaking monsters in this tunnel. There's monsters. Freaking Peyton. Peyton? It's Peyton Manning. Ow, he punched me in the face. Can I get an RPG where Peyton Manning is one of the bosses? And he punches you in the face? That would be a, wouldn't he throw footballs at you? I mean, maybe. Oh my god, why would you... Nemesis! Ooh, my name nema Ooh, my name nema Ooh, my name nema Ooh, my name nema Sis. I'm gonna kick him. In case he's gonna take end. all the damage. And you. And me. Oh, uh, now I'm paralyzed. Casey's also paralyzed. Good job you cut them all in half. I hate that arm raise motion he does. Or the Dark Knight does. It's the Dark Knight. Hey, Batman. Yo, it's got $20,000. See, and you were complaining about buying those potions. I'm still complaining about buying those potions. If you keep complaining about buying those potions, I'm gonna sell your sheep and your new coin. No. We did it. We won. And I've become even stronger. And we got money bags. Ooh. Check out. What's on my Pokemon Go game? Oh, Pokemon. It's a Ranguru. Yes. Nemesis! That sounds like the name of, uh... That stuffed animal that Candace and... Mm -hmm. Her friend whose name escapes me also. Yeah. What's Candace's friend's name? Uh, Stacy. Thank you. The Candace and Stacy got in the Meep episode. Yeah. Bangaroos. Something like that. We'll put him to strike. We win this. So I kick him, you cut him. Together, we will win. And like five different doors to go through. This one. <laughs> this, what, what is this room? <laughs> it's the bone room, bro. Why does Doga have a bone room? 
Dogo, what's going on in your freaking mansion? Why do you not have a bone room? Because I don't have hundreds of bones I need to keep some of them. Well, why not? <laughs> I feel like you're slacking you and you're attacking. I think you do. Got a shining cut, and no idea what that even is. Oh, that, that looks, looks awesome. Nice. Fucking Pouton! Pouton! Hit him in the face. We did it. I thought it was water. Then I think Peyton's. Then I think. Then I think Peyton's second form should be a dragon with Peyton Manning's head. Did you then eat the water? No, I accidentally burned myself. You made it. We're about to complete the Eureka Keep. But first, you must defeat both Une and me in battle. That's right. Think you can handle us? Uh, can I heal up first? What? Why do we have to fight you? Listen well. Long ago, mankind came into possession of weapons far too powerful for them to wield. They were sealed away in Eureka, but now they are necessary. In order to go to Eureka, you need the key. But to create this key, we need massive amounts of energy. Energy we can only produce in battle. Okay, can I heal up first? No, Dogo, you know, there has to be another way. We can't fight you, you're friends. Innocent fools, if you do not attack me, then I will take the initiative. Prepare yourselves. Can I heal up? Dogo, please. Ah. That is not what I expected Dogo to look like. Dogo, you're looking a little... Looking a little, little sus there. You're not punching the face. Maybe that'll fix it. That was a good punch. Hi, I stole a high potion from him. I don't think you like Casey stealing a high post before. I think he has a little mad at Casey for that. Um. Raise them. Tell me how you live it when you raise them. Check this real situation. Come on, Alex, raise them. Ow. And the cherub from the sky. Bequeesh you with life, but not very many hit points. Quick, use high potion on yourself, so you don't fucking die. I mean, I do have a Kyogre here, but it takes the same MP as my raise. My raise so. Use a high so you don't die. Punch Doga in the face. Is he dead yet? Oh, I'm dead. At least we're not having to fight Doga and Unate. I'm alive, time. somehow. We're doing a lot of damage to them. We are quite strong. Yes, but they're not defeated yet, is my point. Use a hype potion on me so that I don't die. Get on that hype potion! Oh, okay, well, it was nice knowing you. Alas, poor Gaba. I knew him, Alex. Hey, you avenged me. Huh. But I'm dead for this next fight. Now, may maybe you and I will give us a little second deal up. I gotta take your time. Please don't die, Doga. Next you will face me. Are you ready? No. I, I'm not ready. Now is not the time for chit-chat. Don't worry. Even if our bodies perish, our spirits can't be destroyed. I'm literally knocked out now on the floor. Me. I'm knocked out on the floor. <sighs> Again, not what I thought she looked like from her little sprite. They do not listen. Um, you, you did save before you came in here, right? No. Because the last time we saved was before I did the Earth Crystal Palace. No, worry, there's auto saves. Okay. The little auto saves. I hate the auto saves. It doesn't feel right. Would you rather have to go through all that again? I'd rather play the game the way it was intended to be played. Oh, I'm dead again. Great, cool, love it. Yeah, the way it was intended to play is dumb. I mean, Pro Jerry calls Final Fantasy IV a sissy baby game. I wonder what he thinks of this version of Final Fantasy III. He also thinks the original version of Final Fantasy III is freaking terrible near the end with how difficult it gets. We're not even at the end yet, though. We'll put him at the end. He's only referring to the last dungeon in the original, which is notoriously bad. Alex, please survive that. She will survive. Then she'll use cure on you, so now the both of you're alive. Now could you please raise my body, and maybe Casey it's too, so now. we can get back to the battle, so that we can assist you. Oh, Alex is dead. Great. 
die. I'll just keep on punching. I'm not sure that's the sound of strategy. I'm, dead. I'm alive. Die. No. Do you only use holy? Holy. Hey, time for the first time flying Doga Yune. Now, this time I'm actually gonna heal up before the battle. Which they did not give me a chance to do. Well, not to be fair. You could have healed up. You just you know, didn't know you needed to. Well, I'm oh, Doga and Yune, my friends. I, I want to heal up. Yes, yes, cutscene. I, I honestly do not care. Well, we have to fight you. No, we can't fight you. Guess we're gonna fight you. I mean, is this what he always looked like when we were just hanging out earlier? No. Because if so, we should have been a little sus. Yeah. Cast a magic reflecting spell. Huh, that seems like a useful item. Yeah, especially against Une. Cast a protective magic spell. Cause an earthquake, it'll work. Creates a rift to another method. You know, I doubt it'll work, but when else are we gonna use the black hole? I don't hate the armor. Yeah, I, I doubt it would work. But it's like, are we ever gonna use it at a different time? I could probably survive that. I could survive that. The high potion, me Casey. Well, Alex, I don't know. Cast freaking. I, I don't even know. <laughs> Like really nothing good to cast. I guess, I guess the cast to kill on the whole party. Could have tried arrow. Just in case. Yeah, but I knew I wanted to do all that much damage. Probably, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> You're alive! Barely! Still barely. Be a slightly more alive than before. Well, I Probably didn't need the high potion on the cure. For all the attention you all are giving me. Yeah, both the high potion and the cure one, I say. Honestly, Casey doesn't Well, it's nice damage. to have a little bit of redundancy in case one of the characters dies before they can yeah. take their turn. Can we take out Doge already? I got 21 hits. Alright, it's not bad. That's the same amount as the all pilots. Okay, hand me out. I'm gonna I'm gonna use like the two shining curtains you have on me on on, on me and you. All right. Although we're not the healers. Okay, but we're the damage dealers. So, and since Una literally only uses magic. It's like you don't need a healer if you're not taking damage. Yeah, well, let's see how well this works. Well, it might. Before we go putting our eggs in that basket. I think it's 4,000 damage. How much you can survive that, right? See, put. Uh, just scram. <laughs> I'm just gonna get out of here. Bye, guys. But I don't think I don't think I can use haste on you guys now. I even use kill on you guys. How's reflect look? I won't heal them, will it? No. Oh, thank God. Yeah, this battle just became trivial. Yep. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I didn't think they'd die that quickly. Guess we didn't get much damage off last time. I mean, we don't have any more shining curtains, but... That's a little disappointing. Doga, Une... Oh man, that sucks. Now, the Eureka key is complete. Hang it with you. Wow, thanks. Doga, no! Don't fret. My spirit will live on, no matter what state my body is in. It is up to you now. Go to Circus Tower, beyond the statues. 
Sande is attempting to call forth darkness into this world. It must be stopped. You know, that sounds like a Kingdom Hearts name. You must get to Circus Tower to enter Eureka. It probably Even Circus Tower sounds like it if it were spelled differently. <laughs> Here, take this. It's the Circus Key. You'll need this to open the door to the tower. You are not alone. We will continue to watch over you, please. Stop. Santa. Oh, no. You could put That's a little more though. motion into your readings there. <laughs> oh, no. Is this what you're going to be like when we do Mario Wars on the podcast in a couple of weeks? I don't know. I'll be very emotional, but I'm not. When you do C-3P Toad. The Mario doesn't need to be emotional if it's C-3PO. C-3PO doesn't have that much emotion. I mean, it's like, oh, dear. Curse my metal body. I wasn't fast enough. Yo, I can go up to the... Uh, oh, oh yeah, uh, Doga's, do Doga's dead, guys. Shh, don't tell him. You got any magic I can buy? Ah, oh, nothing that good. Bye. Uh, so I start hanging the... I mean, I don't think we're gonna finish it in one episode, but we can. Alright, let's go. I gotta go back and get the Invincible. Because we need to fly over some more mountains. Invincible. I gotta go get the Invincible. You should really not be able to put this ship inside the I Invincible agree. so you I can agree. switch at any time. Because we're really like, alright, I'll go all the way back to get my Invincible. I'm find out where I, I guess that was just too complicated for the time. You know, but especially with, I guess the Pixel Master won't be faithful enough. And that did change a decent bit. I was they just threw auto saves into it, so why not? That's for convenience. It's for sissy babies. Honestly, one of the most annoying things to me is we're like halfway the dungeon. But that's then part you of die the experience. And, have to go back to the and it's I, your fault for not saving often enough. Well, even if I save at the beginning of the dungeon, I don't want to go that entire dungeon again. But that's part of the game. If you get defeated in a dungeon, you do it over. You don't just respawn right there. But it's annoying. That's why they added save points next to bosses in later games. It's essentially the same thing. No, because the save point, you still have to take the time to use it. You still have to actively participate. It's not the game you're saying, Oh, you died, little buddy. Here, I'll start you back right here. Is it the save points won't end this game? I'm sorry, I don't like it. I'm just saying, a save point, and like, Are we okay? I have to walk through this. A save point, like the womb boss, and an auto save, and the womb with the boss is pretty much the same thing. It's not, though, because you have to actively make use of the save point, and you can always choose not to. I have to walk through these. Uh huh. Well, I can also choose not to return. Wait, to now they're crumbling, though. Can you go back and get the ship? Wait, I got. Let, let me break all of them first. Crumble them all, then go back and get the ship. That, that was the plan. I know I need to. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's annoying. Why can't That's you just so fly weird. the ship? And, like, why did you walk through them crumbled giant statues big enough to stop your ship from going through? Well, you see, because of the fangs. Hmm? Because of the fangs we have. I think I think that's what the fangs did. I suppose. Gosh, I got. I gotta kill some false flies. At least they're hell it's fine cover. Those are the weirdest flies I've ever seen. They literally look like fish. Wow, Casey did a lot of damage with that knife. Where'd you get all that damage? You did like 600 earlier. Doo -doo. Wow, can I just go across the tower? Can I just hop in there? Can I save my game to hop in there? You know, there's a, a, a greater depth of story in this game compared to the original, mainly because you have these other characters interwoven. Oh, it's the Earth Crystal. It's the Earth Crystal, but something attacks. You're surrounded. But overall, on Map Zonda's orders, you are always swallowed by darkness. Overall, I feel like the original Final Fantasy has a deeper story than this. It, isn't it the same guy we killed like five minutes ago? Uh, he wasn't called Titan. 
Like, guys, it's the same freaking guy. And he's a bit stronger. But don't you feel like there's a little more depth to the quest in the original compared to this? Yeah. And the Final Fantasy II has way more story than this does. I yeah. suppose, like, having the jobs in this sort of make up for the depth. Because even, like, Final Fantasy V, I think, has less story than four or six. Final Fantasy V definitely has less story. But then it has, you know, the job system... They really need a nice balance between game so you get and a little, story. So you get a little more depth than that. And I'm not coming down on either game. Yeah. Three or five, I'm just making an observation. I mean, don't get me wrong, I prefer the original to three, and I prefer four and six to five, but they're all good games. <laughs> Some of them are downright great games. I'm doing quite a lot of damage pumps in this guy, right? You guys' blades are not. I think you guys need better blades. My fists are doing great. I mean, it's I mean, not a haste on me, but... Honestly, I'd probably say Final Fantasy V is a great game, too. It is a fucking great game. It's just not as good as 4 and 6. I agree it's not as good as 6. Oh, don't, even, don't even pretend that it's better than 4. It might be. 4 story blows this away. I mean, Kane turns on you like 18 times. He gets brainwashed at least twice. That's epic writing right there. I mean, come on, Final Fantasy IV is anime as fuck. Casey, they got freaking destroyed. I mean, you seriously? Okay, just story for story. You're not gonna argue that five is better than four. No. Okay. But gameplay. But, but, but at the same time, I feel like there's a greater depth of gameplay in Final Fantasy. You may have more options with the uh, with the job system, but I feel like there's more to do in 4. Maybe. I feel like it's a deeper game. Anyway, I guess we get the Earth Crystal now. It's the fourth and final crystal. The Earth Crystal. Wait, didn't we get that already? What? No. No. Oh. We haven't. What were we getting in the cave just now? We got the Fang of us. Oh, okay. Duh. Warriors of Light, the mortal known as Anya is using my powers for the utmost evil. He plans to drown the world in darkness. Man, that sucks. You must use the power within me to cast away the cloud of darkness. Okay. Go away, cloud. Come back for Final Fantasy Shoot. VII. Yeah, we got new tiles. Magus, Devout, and Summoner Jobs. Three things we'll never use. Actually, we will use those. Three things we will use. Why will we use them? Do we have to? Well, Devout is a little a better white mage. So we're really gonna give up all those job points we're gonna Yep! <laughs> Spent the whole game with this But even past, in like five minutes, we'll, there's like a bonus dungeon. <laughs> like, it's just an even better mage job. Circus Tower is a conductor for light. Zande plans to use it to amplify our powers and summon the Cloud of Darkness. Go now to Circus Tower and stop Zande, Warriors of Is Light. Is that called the Crystal Tower? Hope of the Earth. I'll go, I'm gonna go take a nap. We could probably call this episode here if you want. Alright. Alright, thanks for watching this edition of Final Fantasy 3 and a half. Come back next time for more Final Fantasy 3 action. In the meantime, please check out all the other videos we bring to you. But hey, I don't have to tell you all how to YouTube, like, comment, subscribe, or good stuff. And we'll be back with more videos before you know it. Now I'm Maddie. Dylan. Until next time, we'll video to see you. Peace out, y'all. Bye. Thank you for watching. Now we invite you to do all that good stuff. Comment, subscribe, like. Just letting you know, not trying to be rude. I don't have to tell you how to YouTube. But please tune in for the next show. We'll be back with more video see before you know. For Maddie and Dylan, etc. At all, we will video see you. Peace out, y'all.